Shorty, get down, good lord. Let's be focused, let's, let's be, be totally serious, focused. let's be pros. Ask us questions Jen's now. The most fun was dancing and singing our butts off for three months. Maybe Becca has a point. Maybe we could try something oh, Excuse new. me? Okay, awkward. Those girls are hilarious. Everybody is so funny to me. It's very nice to see a dude that's just unafraid to look stupid. Mm -hmm. So that's kind of what I did. You're one of those acapella girls, I'm one of those acapella boys, and we're going to have acapella children. It's inevitable. It was cool to see it all together. They have literally put in all the work to make these performance pieces in the movie absolutely jump off the screen. I developed some swag. You got some swag. Welcome to Barton University. This is a list of all of the songs that we have ever performed. There's nothing from this century on here. It's not enough to be good, we need to be different. This was kind of similar to my experience of, of putting on a play or a musical, probably, more like. And uh, I think... Why? Well, just because, I don't know, uh, there's some similar there some elements. It. It's a comedy, it makes you laugh, our actors make us laugh. But I think some of the things that was probably fun for us to put together behind the scenes was uh, the musical numbers, rehearsing them for four weeks, putting everyone through a lot of blood, sweat, and tears to get them to the point where they could sing and be funny. It's got some action, it's got romance, it's funny as hell, and then it's got a lot of singing and a lot of dancing, and it's just one of those fun movies that everyone can enjoy. Our goal is to get to the finals. How are we paying for regionals? A bikini car wash is definitely out of the question. No, Aubrey, I'm like super good at bikini car washes. <laughs> It's a bunch of young people. Some people, this is like their first film that they've ever done. And the energy is really high and really good. This is a musical, obviously, and also it, it helped that the people that we were working with were so talented, but also just such great people, and we really bonded together. It's all fun, a lot of it. A lot of it was fun. <laughs> I was looking around all the time being like, this is really an actor's dream job to get to just have fun, learn dance moves, and get to just hang out with cool people. I'm not leaving here until you sing. Bulletproof, fire away, fire away. You have a lovely voice. Thanks. I was a little yes. nervous about the whole thing because I'm not a singer or a dancer. The culmination of everything when it's all together was pretty cool to see. I learned so much about acapella, to be honest. I didn't know much going in what was, you know, how hard and difficult it was to practice so much with your note and to go in, you know, with the group of girls and really try to hit it and lock it in. I mean, it takes a lot of work. Oh, wow, wow. There will be no more wasting time with school or boyfriends. Can I trust you will add your own cardio? Yeah, no, don't put me down for cardio. What are you doing? Horizontal running. I had more fun like behind the scenes, like when we had these 10, 20 minutes that were just sitting there and everybody's getting delusional and all of a sudden there's real jokes started happening and you're just waiting. I just laughed so much behind the scenes. And also hanging out, you know, afterwards with all these really cool people and really great actors and really hysterically funny people. I mean, we would be laughing from when we woke up in the morning till, you know, some, when we said goodbye at the night. It really felt like they were in college, you yeah. know? It's like they, ha they had to be in class all the time <laughs> together and eat together and, and hang out together, together and went yeah. drinking together. So it was like they lived together sort of dorm style. <laughs> we really benefited, the movie benefited from the sort of authenticity of the experience experience that they were all having. And then at lunch we were quiet. And at lunch we were like, we, really they were not laughing. Lunch was very serious. Yeah. What boring estrogen filled set have you prepared for us? Hey Amy! I was just waiting shot! You guys are gonna get pitch slapped so hard, your man boobs are gonna concave. Pitch Perfect follows Becca Mitchell. She's a college freshman trying to figure out her place in the world. Hi, any interest in joining our music group? Whenever you're ready, dude. Oh, not a dude. We sing songs without any instruments. It's all from our mouths. Yikes. The Bellas are an all-female a cappella group at our fictional Barden University. Sorry, I don't even sing. Becca thinks that a cappella music is kind of lame. Bulletproof, fire away. Ha! Oh my god! You can sing! You have to join the Bellas. The troublemakers, the rock stars of a cappella. Whip it! That's what being a man's all about. This is a travesty. The Barn University troublemakers are the bad boys of acapella. They always win. 
The trebles are our competition. You girls are awesome. We horrible. I hate you. Kill yourselves. Girl power. We will stop at nothing to take those dinglings down. The trebles don't respect us. This is war. I am confident that we will find super hot girls with perfect pitch. I wouldn't pass this up. It'll be fun. You'll see. But she's reluctantly recruited along with a plethora of misfits. Do you guys want to see a dead body? My hobbies include cuticle care and the e-network. Oh, there's no backup dancers? Okay. What's your name? Fat Amy. You call yourself Fat Amy? Yes. Fat Amy is basically the best singer in this whole movie. Sing ah. ah. Let's just get that straight. Are you guys getting ready for the riff off? What's a riff off? Oh, Mickey, you're so fine, you're so fine, you blow my mind. Hey, Mickey! Shorty, get down, good lord. Strictly bitch, you don't play around. Cover much ground, got game by the pound. Oh, I like the way you work, uh -huh. No digging. I gotta bang it away, uh -huh. The riff off is actually based on a bunch of parties I used to go to as a theater nerd. Someone would be on the piano, and we would just sort of throw music back and forth at each other and someone would start a song and then we start another song and essentially what Kay Cannon did, our screenwriter, she called that into an actual competition that we call the riff off. And our next category is Woo! songs about sex. Sex? Baby, let's talk about you and me. Let's talk about all the good things and the bad things that may be. Let's talk about sex. All right. Let's talk about sex. A little bit, a little bit.